Hello students, I am Dr. Yogesh Kumar Yadav and today we will discuss about the characters and affinities of Rotifera and this is the third part and in this third part uh, we will discuss about the affinities of Rotifera. Uh, let us look at the affinities of Rotifera and they are having the resemblances with Arthropoda, Tocophore larva, Petty Helminthes and Nematoda and uh, first of all we are taking the affinities with Arthropoda. Actually, we see uh, that uh, uh, the body covering that is composed of a cuticle and it is uh, uh, found in arthropoda also. Second is the superficial metamerism, means uh, the body looks like uh, that uh, there is metamerism, but uh, that is not uh, uh, true metamerism, metamerism as is found in the arthropod. Third is the presence of two jaws, those are known as the trophy, and fourth one, the moving whistle hearing arms of Idalia suggest the appendages of a crustacean larva. So these are the affinities with Arthropoda. Second affinities are with the trochophore larva. Actually uh, some adult rot rotifers they resemble with the free living trochophore larva. And this uh, trochophore larva is of uh, Annelida, Mollusca, Nematinia and Bryozoa. The peculiar rotifera that is a trochosphera that appears almost like a sexually mature trochophore with a mastex. Hmm? The ciliary girdle, band intestine, and excretory organs are topographically similar to corresponding part of the trochophore. Means uh, uh, this uh, uh, elementary canal, okay, means the intestine and the excretory organ. They are topographically similar hmm, to the corresponding part of the tocophore larva. That is uh, the main feature. And third, we see that the affinities with the platyhelminthes are the first affinities with the platyhelminthes is that uh, the primitive type of corona that may be uh, derived from a complete or ventral ciliation as in turbularians. Okay, so in turbularians, uh, we see that uh, there is uh, a complete or a ventral ciliation, hmm? which is uh, found in uh, just we can see that in the rotiferans there is a uh, in head region we are uh, having some ciliary corona. Okay. Second, the formation of cuticularized part such as trophy is also common in turbulations. Okay. The third one is the the protonephridial system with uh, flame bulbs, recalling that of uh, rhabdocele is definitely against the derivation of rotifers. Uh, from any higher group. The fourth point is that the retrocerebral organ is probably homologous with the frontal organ of the turbulations. Okay, and the fifth point is the female gonads show divisions into germarium and vitellarium, as in platforms. Now we see uh, the affinities with nematoda. The rotifers resemble the nematodes in being composed of a relatively few cells having a nuclear constancy, a syncytial epidermis and a body cavity without a special lining. Thank you very much.